What if we told you that in this grand cosmic theater, we might be mere characters scripted in an intricate mathematical code? What if we shared with you a discovery that links the wisdom of an ancient African tribe with the pillars of our digital world? Could the same codes that guide your web browsers and search engines also be steering the universe itself? In the complex world of theoretical physics, where the abstruse intersects with reality, a compelling narrative has unfolded. Led by the esteemed Professor James Gates Jr., a distinguished physicist and former scientific advisor to President Obama at the University of Maryland, a team of extraordinary researchers set forth on an intellectual expedition comprising some of the finest minds in supersymmetry and theoretical physics, they sought to decode the elusive mystery that has always enthralled mankind, the fabric of space-time itself, otherwise known as the ether. The ether, that elusive concept, can be considered the soup of reality, the cosmos within which we reside. Since the days of antiquity, humans have speculated about the nature of this matrix. What is it composed of? What forces govern it? With a focus on this enigmatic substance, Professor Gates and his team pursued a trail leading to an unexpected source, an ancient civilization in Mali, Africa, known as the Dogen tribe. The Dogen people, renowned for their astronomical knowledge and complex cosmology, left behind symbolic patterns called Adinkra symbols. While these symbols initially seemed an unlikely place to seek answers to high-level physics questions, Gates was drawn to their symmetry and complexity. His intuition paid off when he realized these symbols were more than merely artistic expressions. They represented mathematical codes. It was no casual mathematical code that the Dogon symbols were found to be emblematic of, but one that intricately described the structure and dynamics of the space-time continuum. What was even more fascinating was the discovery that these Adinkra codes shared an unexpected kinship with something familiar in our digital era. Error Correcting Codes Error-correcting codes are integral in digital communication. They underpin the technology that drives our search engines, web browsers, and most digital systems. They help to detect and correct errors that occur during the transmission of digital data, ensuring reliable communication amidst the chaos of the digital world. It's intriguing, to say the least, that the same codes that maintain order in our digital lives were echoed in ancient symbols, and further, that they seem to map onto the fabric of the universe itself. In effect, this discovery implies that our universe might operate on a system akin to a software program. This radical concept, reminiscent of the simulated reality hypothesis popularized by the Matrix series, posits that the universe runs on a code written by an unknown programmer. Understanding the ether through this novel perspective could transform our perception of reality, much like how Newton's gravitational laws or Einstein's theory of relativity did. It implies a deterministic universe, run by mathematical principles that govern everything from the tiny electron's whirl to the colossal motion of galaxies. The concept of a coded universe does not entirely diverge from existing scientific theories. Quantum mechanics, the most successful theory we have, embraces the idea of a probabilistic universe governed by wave functions and uncertainty principles. Similarly, string theory, a leading candidate for a theory of everything, proposes that reality is made of minuscule, vibrating strings. In this context, the concept of the universe as a program is not as far-fetched as it seems. However, questions abound. If the universe is indeed running on a code, who or what wrote it? Could it be merely the result of emergent patterns from an initial state of chaos? Or does it imply a conscious designer? And what does it mean for free will and consciousness, our deeply held beliefs about our autonomy and subjective experiences? 
our perception of the universe as an ethereal, intangible entity could be reshaped by viewing it as a structured, coded system. It suggests that there might be a higher degree of order and predictability to the cosmos than what we perceive. It opens new doors in the quest for a theory of everything, hinting at a hidden structure underlying all of existence. This narrative underscores the beauty of scientific exploration, as it fuses ancient wisdom, complex mathematics, and modern digital technology. It is an example of how science progresses, not linearly, but by connecting dots between seemingly disparate domains, ignited by curiosity and driven by the urge to understand. The work of Professor Gates and his team has led to a pioneering perspective that may reframe our understanding of the universe. From the intricate patterns of the Dogon tribe to the ones and zeros of our digital world, the exploration of the ether's nature unravels as a thrilling symphony of mathematical harmony, revealing that we might, indeed, be living within a vast cosmic software. This understanding doesn't diminish the grandeur of the cosmos, but enhances it, offering profound insight into the intertwined dance of existence and knowledge. Another area where we find fascinating mathematical patterns which echo the concept of a coded reality is numerology, an ancient practice that associates numbers with specific meanings and attributes. Although often considered a part of esoteric traditions, numerology's principles bear some intriguing connections with modern scientific concepts. For instance, consider the ubiquitous presence of the golden ratio in nature, architecture, and art. This number, often denoted by the Greek letter phi, is approximately 1.618033988875 and has fascinated mathematicians for centuries due to its extraordinary properties. It is found in the spiral arrangement of leaves and flowers, the proportions of the human body, the shape of galaxies, and even the stock market patterns, revealing an uncanny order beneath apparent chaos. In a more esoteric vein, consider Pythagoras, the ancient Greek mathematician. While he is renowned for his work in geometry, notably the Pythagorean theorem, he was also a mystic who believed in the sacredness of numbers. Pythagoras and his followers attributed specific characteristics to each number, an idea reminiscent of modern numerology. They believed that understanding these numerical associations could offer insights into the nature of the cosmos and human life. Moving to quantum physics, there's the striking concept of quantum numbers. These numbers describe the state of quantum particles like electrons, including their energy level, spin, and orientation. Quantum numbers, thus, appear to encode the behavior of the smallest constituents of matter, reminiscent of the idea of a numerically encoded reality. In essence, both science and numerology seem to embrace the idea that numbers hold keys to understanding the universe and ourselves. Although approached from different perspectives, these fields intersect at the intriguing possibility that reality may operate on mathematical principles, much like a coded program. Perhaps you're intrigued by the prospect of exploring how this numerical encoding might manifest in your own life. If so, here's an opportunity. Click the link in the description below to get a free numerology reading. This could provide an interesting perspective on your life's patterns, potentially revealing a hidden numerical code that underpins your personal experiences. This is not to claim that numerology can offer definitive answers or predictions about your life. Still, much like gazing at the stars or studying the fundamental particles, it could open up new ways of seeing and understanding the world around and within you. You might be surprised by the patterns and coincidences that emerge, and you may find yourself looking at the world in a slightly different light. Delving into the mysteries of numbers, whether through the lens of theoretical physics or the ancient practice of numerology, can truly be a mind-expanding experience. So why not give it a try and see what insights await? As we've seen, reality might indeed be written in a mathematical language, one that spans from the cosmos to you.